Hello guys, welcome to Boxing Block, center on the home of Nigerian African Boxing. Please, if you're new to this channel, make sure you click the like and of course the subscribe button right now. And also go to the notification bell icon, click it and select all. Okay, so to drop in a new exclusivity, you will definitely be notified. So, um, it looks like um, Joshua, the potential clash between Anthony Joshua. Uh, and um, Deontay the Bronze Bumba Wada is on the verge of collapsing. You know, there is a very tricky situation right now. And here on Matter Boxing was very convinced that this fight was going to get made. Wa Team Water was also convinced. But right now, looks like we are is about to hit the rock. And um, it's going to be very sad if it does because I do want to see this fight right here. We need to see this as a bo as boxing fans, and I feel like the politics of boxing should should stop messing with big potential fights like this, especially Wilder having it um, in mind or in one of his plans or as one of his plans uh, to have uh, that fight in. Um, um, in Africa, possibly Nigeria or Ghana or anywhere like South Africa, uh, Nigeria will, will make sense a lot because both um, have the ancestry uh, <clears throat> to Nigeria. And uh, yeah, it's just one of those things you look at as a boxing fan, you get tired of. By the way, I'm gonna be more active here, as you know, I, I apologize um, early on, week on weekends, you know, um, I will do my best to make sure of that oh uh, now let's hear from any here no matter boxing and a um, little bit and uh, yeah we of, of course uh, proceed do that um just because uh, a lot of fans aren't aware of uh, the cuts that are made uh, that have gone out of their purses could you explain uh, if i use a rand figure say 100k mm -hmm. somebody's get, a fighter's getting paid 100k it, it, let's run through promoter management trainer mm -hmm. fees just the money up anymore because there's a new player in town uh, obviously the guys that are putting fury and garner on and they've got control of the boxing in saudi so i'm sure you've seen that you know your response to that yeah i mean firstly obviously prince khalid skills challenge you know been great partners to us and friends um i don't know the political situation obviously shane fury is working with the new entity so he's going to be supportive of that and i'm sure we'll work with that new entity as well they do a great job so yesterday they throw a lot of money in these things it's you know it really makes some noise for us, we've agreed terms for Joshua Wilder, but until we receive a contract, the fight's not happening. Um, obviously, politically, it sounds like there's a lot going on, but for us, we're ready to take that fight. Shelley Finkel and I have spoken, they're ready to take that fight. Everybody's agreed the terms, but until the money's put in place, the fight's not happening. Now, it doesn't just have to happen in Saudi Arabia. There are now other talks about other countries that could take uh, part in. So, yeah, regarding the comments, I think there's some truth to it, that there is a political movement of, not even political, but just a movement of uh, management and ownership of boxing in Saudi. And it's up to them what they want to do. If they don't want to do Joshua Wilder, maybe it goes somewhere else. But it's one of the biggest fights in heavyweight boxing. We're being told they do. But, you know, I said before, I wouldn't even be surprised if Joshua fights Fury. You know, I mean... It's really interesting that listening to, it's quite funny because I've ended up watching Fury on Netflix, right? Which I actually thought was really good. And, you know, you can't well, actually help. Let me just not uh, prolong it too much. Uh, shout out to uh, Boxing King Media for this uh, <clears throat> for this uh, exclusive interview with you know, Matter Boxing. Okay, my take on this is that, okay, um, now, according to you know, Matter Boxing, um, I think um, there's a new man in charge of Saudi boxing, okay, of boxing events in Saudi. So basically, Shane Fury, uh, Team Fury, are uh, work working with uh, that, you know, that new, uh, you know, head of boxing in Saudi. Why the you know, Matra boxing um, had um, had had uh, an agreement with the previous one so basically they need to get in line with a new one and with the new one and um, and see what happens i think listen francis garden versus tyson fury is of a huge fight no doubt but it's not nothing near what uh, joshua fights 
you know what I mean? So I think the fight will get made. Um, uh, the hearing, of course, is as a very, you know, the guy is a business guy. Like he's already exploring uh, other options and stuff like that. Even case that doesn't happen. But I think it will in this case. I just hope it doesn't collapse because boxing is this. We need this. We need to see water. Um, uh, Joshua, we need to see it. like we've been starved of this fight for years. You know, so many egos, so many back and forth um, words being thrown out. So many like people were even going into uh, each other's shelf. You know, to bring out dirty their dirty laundries and stuff like that. Come on, if this fight doesn't happen, it would be a shame. And uh, especially Wado wanted it to be a two fight deal. You know, one in Saudi Arabia and another one in somewhere in Africa, in a country in Africa, uh, possibly Nigeria. Yeah, man, I don't know what you guys make of this. Give it a thumbs below, like the video, share, subscribe. I just hope it doesn't collapse, you know. So, guys, God bless you, your followers, for the channel. Of course, we'll, be def we'll definitely drop more bangers. Stay tuned for all our exclusive uh, content, you know, to come because I'm back. Take off at me now Am I not good enough for you? Why don't you notice me? I notice everything new about you but why don't